Hello guys, I'm back again. It's been a while since I've done a video, but um, I had to do one. I got in a swap with uh, MAS, Mini Album Scrap. Ah, got that right. Um, I joined the, I think it's the embellishment one, they're doing an altered bingo card. And this is my second time I get into a swap. And so I'm kind of excited. Um, I guess the theme is um, just a bingo card and you pretty much can do anything you want with them. Um, no theme whatsoever, but you have to embellish it. Anyways, this is what I did. I wanted something um, vintage yet shabby chic. I haven't really, I haven't done anything like that. So I'm kind of excited and I'm very happy the way they came out. So all my six little bingo cards are ready. Um, let me get a little close-up of one. I guess I'll choose this one here. Um, what I did was interesting. <laughs> I've heard so many things on, well, seen so many things on YouTube, and uh, I wanted to try something cool, like things that are going out out there. And on my bingo card, what I did is I, uh, I put Yeso first to kind of... Uh, darken the letters because my bingo card was the blue, like a royal blue, so I thought it was kind of like too strong. So what I did is I put yeso to kind of dye down the color and then uh, I distressed it. I used vintage photo and uh, a little bit of black soot around it and I kind of distressed the edges too. Grab my scissors and crunched it up a bit and then I um, distressed it with the um, black suit and then I also use my dabber also my black dabber just to you know make it um, stand out a little more from the edges and then at the end I ended up putting some Mod Podge to kind of give it a little more of a smooth finish uh, and seal all those little colors in there so it's a little shiny from the Mod Podge as you can see now what I did is I, I did a little dress form had some little some little um, lace here and then a little trim there and I also use the same one for the back and um, I also did this uh, gosh, what are these called I rolled up some string there a little button um, yeah little button and this flower I made it myself as you can see it really good but I followed um, Fiona's tutorial so I'm sure you guys know who Fiona is uh, she has a great tutorial on how to do them um, and actually this one I didn't put the little feet Sorry, that's my baby. But this is the first one I did. I didn't put these little beads on it, but uh, it was a little too big for the card, so I didn't use this size. I made more of a uh, miniature ones. So this is what I came up with, and I uh, put another little trim on the bottom, little pearls, little pearl trim. Oh, and I had a little flower there to bring more of the pink here. And I kind of distressed it a little bit in the edges to go with the the theme. I really like the way it came out. I'm really happy with it. Um, so I'm going to get ready to ship them out tomorrow. But I wanted to share. I'm very excited. Um